ends up in the eclipse room, uh, given the flat earthers hell and said, mediocrities do not have a voice here. We will talk about the red heifers and we will talk about, uh, we'll talk about the fact that the eclipse path just happened to happen to come over the Schofield study Bible belt. The Schofield study Bible, by the way, is where your, your dispensational rapturist premillennial uh, eschatology emerged out of Darby in 1820, by the way. Well, I have, I have a question so, for you. Are, are white people, we're still ruling the galaxy, right? The white Christians? I mean, somebody's, 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 somebody's got to be a space marine, and it ain't going to be Shaniqua. <laughs> white people are going to rule the galaxy. That's my favorite quote from last night. Yeah, well... I had a, I had a little a little bit to drink. I was celebrating the <laughs> celebrating the red heifer, <laughs> the blood of the red heifer to usher in the construction of the third temple. I was celebrating just like everybody. <laughs> you gotta say with your chest. So this though. is a, huh? You gotta say with your chest, like white people are gonna rule the galaxy. Oh man, I can't. Well, I'm not. I'm I'm being trying to be serious. We're actually talking about we're talking about what what. what what is the justification of Christian of Christians to manage Christian nations? And um, and obviously, I have a history politically that's that's hardcore. But I'm trying to find a a way to to understand that to be more moderate about it, because my conversion to Christianity meant that I, I you know, the pursuit of power for power is not good enough. There has to be truth. And as a Christian, there's a there's the highest truth. As a believer, I believe that you know this truth is is so true that any anything that comes it, that is not based upon this truth is is going to be rotten and up to and including evil. So anyway, that's what we're doing here. To the guy that just came in and wanted to hear me in my revelry mode last night, uh, that's not going to happen. But anyway, you guys go ahead. I'm taking the room.